Their mother sold them when they were born. Daisy and Violet were born conjoined at the hip. Their mother didn't want them, so she sold them to her boss, Mary Hilton. Mary immediately saw an opportunity to make fast money. She would display the girls in local pubs where drunk men would lift their skirts to see where they were joined. Mary was extremely cruel, beating them when they didn't listen to her and forcing them to sing and dance. She toured them across Germany, Australia, and the United States, and they became world famous. Mary didn't give the girls any of the money that they made. After Mary died, her daughter Edith took ownership of the twins. She was just as cruel as her mother and kept the girls captive, allowing them to leave only when it was time to perform. Eventually, the girls could sue Edith and they were finally free. But the girls weren't as popular as they were before. On their final tour, the girls were abandoned by their tour manager. With no money or transport, the girls had no choice but to find jobs at a local grocery store to get by. Daisy and Violet died of the flu at around 60 years old. From their own mother to their captors, everyone else benefited off of them while they lived a horrible life.